Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, triangle uh, ABC that consists of these uh, two triangles. The isosceles uh, triangle uh, ADB and the other right triangle uh, ADC. As you can see in this given diagram, such that uh, this angle uh, ACD is uh, 60 degrees. And moreover, this side AB length is 6 units. And furthermore, this side AD length equal to this side BD length. And now our task is to calculate the area of this green shaded triangle. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started and here's our very first step since we are interested in calculating the area of this green shaded triangle ABC. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area is always equal to a half times base times the height of the triangle. And here we can see this side BC is the base whereas this AD is the height of this uh, green shaded triangle. So therefore now our task is uh, to find this side uh, BC length uh, and likewise we are going to find this uh, AD height length as well. And now we are going to focus on this uh, triangle uh, ADB. We can see this is a right uh, triangle and we can see that this uh, triangle is also an isosceles triangle since uh, this side uh, AD equal to this side BD. I'm going to label this side as uh, lowercase a. Then this side has got to be lowercase a as well. And now we are going to solve for uh, lowercase a value. And now we are going to apply the Pythagorean theorem on this uh, triangle. And here's our Pythagorean theorem, a square plus b square equal to c square. And in our case, our hypotenuse is 6, whereas our two other legs are lowercase a and lowercase a as well. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this Pythagorean formula. So we got uh, a square plus likewise a square equal to 6 uh, square. And now I'm going to divide both sides by 2. So therefore... Uh, a square is going to be equal to 18 and now I am going to undo this uh, square by taking uh, the square root on both uh, sides. So therefore our lowercase a value simply turns out to be 3 times the square root of 2 units. So therefore we could see that this uh, lowercase a value turns out to be 3 times square root of 2 and likewise this lowercase a value is 3 times square root of 2 units as well. And now our only task is to calculate this segment CD length. And now we are going to focus on this right triangle ADC. In this triangle this angle is a 90 degrees angle. This is a 60 degrees angle so therefore uh, this angle has got to be 30 degrees angle so therefore we could see that this uh, triangle ADC is a special uh, 30 60 90 triangle before we proceed any further let me go over the basic concepts and let's focus on this uh, special 30 60 90 triangle uh, ADC and here we can see 30 degrees is our uh, smallest angle whereas uh, this angle 90 degrees uh, is our largest angle. So therefore uh, the side opposite to this smallest angle is going to be our uh, smallest leg. Whereas the side opposite to this largest angle is going to be our longest leg and that is also called the hypotenuse. So therefore in such kind of special 30, 60, 90 triangle the longest leg is always twice the smallest leg. In other words, uh, if the smallest leg is 1, then the longest leg has got to be 2. And this third leg uh, is going to be the square root of 3. And in general, if our smallest leg is uh, x, then our longest leg is going to be 2 times uh, x. Then the third leg has got to be 
x times the square root of 3. And now we are going to revert our attention back to our this original problem. And here we can see this CD is our smallest leg, whereas uh, this side uh, AC is our longest leg, which is also called the hypotenuse. Therefore, I'm going to label this CD length uh, as uh, x, then the longest leg is going to be 2 times uh, x, and this uh, third leg is going to be x uh, times uh, the square root of uh, 3. And now let's make an observation. We can see that this uh, AD segment length uh, is equal to 3 times the uh, square root of 2. And it is also equal to x times square root of 3 as well. So therefore I'm going to equate uh, both of these values. So therefore I could write uh, x uh, times uh, the square root of 3 is going to be equal to 3 times uh, the square root of 2. And now I'm going to divide both sides uh, by square root of 3 to isolate uh, x. And here we can see square root of 3, square root of 3 is gone. So therefore x uh, turns out to be equal to 3 times the square root of 2 divided by the square root of uh, 3. And now I am going to rationalize this uh, denominator by multiplying uh, and dividing by square root of 3 at the very same time. And now we can see square root of 3 times square root of 3 is going to give us simply 3. And here we can see this 3 and 3 is gone. So therefore our x value simply turns out to be equal to square root of 6 units. So therefore our this segment CD length which is x turns out to be equal to square root of 6. So therefore uh, this whole uh, BC side length uh, is going to be equal to 3 times uh, square root of 2 plus uh, square root of 6. So I can write 3 times uh, square root of 2 plus uh, square root of 6. And here's our final step. Now we are going to calculate the area of this triangle uh, ABC. And now let's recall once again the area of a triangle formula. Area is always equal to a half times base times the height of the triangle. And here in our case, uh, the base of this uh, triangle is uh, 3 times square root of 2 plus square root of 6, whereas the height is 3 times square root of 2. So therefore, uh, this green triangle area is going to be equal to a half uh, times uh, 3 times uh, square root of 2 and then times uh, 3 times uh, square root of 2 plus uh, square root of uh, 6. And now I'm going to multiply 1 divided by 2 times 3. And then I'm going to distribute this uh, 2 along with these uh, inside this parenthesis. And here inside this parenthesis, uh, 2 is in common. So therefore I can write uh, 3 divided by 2 and then times uh, 2. I'm going to factor that one out. That is going to give us 3 plus the square root of 3. And now we can see 2 and 2 is gone. So therefore we are ended up with this simply 3 times 3 plus the square root of 3. Let's go ahead and distribute. That is going to give us 9 plus 3 times square root of uh, 3 square uh, units uh, the area of this uh, green shaded triangle ABC so thus after all the calculations and manipulations the area of this green shaded triangle turns out to be 9 plus 3 times square root of 3 square units and that's going to be approximately equal to 14.196 uh, square units as well and that's our final answer Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.